Hey guys, King Cade here and welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm going to be showing y'all a thing that is kind of a glitch to get infinite amount of these things right here. So if y'all don't know, these things actually have a chance for best friend 9, which you get from the final boss in the brand new hunt world on Arm Wrestling Simulator. So, so whenever you defeat this boss, you actually have a chance to get this pet. And then whenever you get the pet, it has an even rarer chance of going ahead and having best friend 9. But in this video, I'm going to be showing y'all a way of how to get tons of these, probably at like at least 15 of them per hour. It all depends on how many accounts you're willing to use. So basically, if it's your first time defeating this dude, then you automatically get one. So if it's your first time beating him, you automatically get one, and then every time you beat him after that, you have a small chance of getting another. So what we're gonna do is basically we're just gonna make tons of alt accounts, and there's actually a trick to this. So what we want to do is we want to trade over our best pets to our alt account. So right now, we currently have this one, which I have more, but I currently have this one equipped, but this one is not the best. This one is only times four strength, which if you want, you could use this one, but I don't recommend it. So basically what you want to do on your main account, just save up enough strength until you can AFK this dude. And then just go ahead and AFK him until you get quite a few gems. Like I went ahead and went AFK for four hours and I currently have 1.9 million. And then on my alt account over here, I currently have 2 million. So it doesn't take too long to get tons of gems. But then once you have tons of gems, you want to go over to this merchant over here and we want to buy this pet. So this pet, it gives us times five, which is currently the best, I believe. But as you can see, it's not in the shop for us. So if it's not in the shop for you what you want to do is you want to leave and rejoin because whenever you leave and rejoin it does reset the shop also by the way you don't need 1.9 million gems i believe you only need like 1 million gems total if you want to get a full team of them but basically you could get these if you want to they're not as good though so since that pet isn't in the shop for us basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave the game just like this and then we're just gonna go ahead and join the game again and by doing this this should reset the shop i believe the shop resets every 20 minutes but this just like resets it instantly and all right is the same stuff up here is different so as you can see it did change up here but down here is still the same stuff so let's just go ahead and rejoin the game so after server hopping for quite a while we finally found one so right over here 225,000. let's go ahead and buy that and there we go so now we have one and now we just can't buy it again because it is empty and let's go ahead and see if we can do it on our alt account because i'm not really sure if it's different per person i think it is though so i'm not really sure if it's gonna be in there and let's see and yep it's sadly not in there so yeah so just go ahead and keep server hopping until you eventually find one though so we need a total of three of them if you don't want to keep server hopping to find one then you could just use these robo dragons or you could just use like the one that you get from there so let's just go ahead and keep server hopping until we can find two more though we now have another one of these things right here we didn't get two more sadly because that's gonna take way too long but we do have two of them so we have two right here so i'm gonna trade over these two and then i'm just gonna go ahead and trade over one of these robo dragons right here it won't be as good but it's only like times one behind so it's not that big of a deal so now what we're gonna do is over on our alt account we're gonna log out and create a new account so this can just be like a throwaway account you don't have to remember anything you just put in some random stuff like this one can just be some random numbers and then some random like password and then we can just select this and then click sign up and there we go it kind of just got blinded but just look up arm wrestling just like that arm wrestling simulator and now click join and pretty much make sure you join your main account because we're gonna trade over these pets and then once you're in the same server you just want to trade over the pets so let's go ahead and trade our main account just like like this and now let's just go ahead and type in hunt select these two pets right there type in a robo and then just select one of these pets click accept hop over to our alt account click accept and then basically these are gonna give us tons of strength and also since the hunt world right here is in world one we don't even need to pass any worlds so here we are we're already over here let's equip best which is only those three pets right there and now let's just go and start grinding strength so this shouldn't take too long we're already gaining quite a bit which of course we'll gain more once we like get some better stuff in here but basically we're just gonna go afk until we can defeat these two people right here because if we defeat this person then he gives us one of those pets which we'll take and then once we defeat this person he'll give us one of those pets which has a chance for best friend eight also while you're afk and whenever you gain strength make sure that you do upgrade your dumbbell over here so that you gain even more strength also if you have more alt accounts that you're able to run while you do this i recommend doing that so while we gain strength on this account we can make another account and we could just trade over even more pets they may not be as good but we could trade over like these pets right over here and then we could have another account gaining strength and also if you have like one of those like insane programs that allows you to open up like 20 accounts at once what you could do open up all 20 accounts don't even trade over any pets just go afk for like an hour and then after an hour on all 20 of those accounts you'll have enough strength to go ahead and defeat this dude so that you could just defeat him and trade over like all 20 of those pets so that would be crazy i don't really have one of those programs but if you
if you do, that'll be cool. I do know some people who have them. But yeah, so here is this account right over here. Let's go and check it again. And we do have quite a bit of strength, so let's make sure that we do upgrade this. There we go. So then we gain even more strength. Also, I don't think any boosts work. So if we type in on the hunt, I believe this is it right here. Let's click verify. And this gives us a four hour boost. But yeah, that doesn't affect it. So we just gotta go ahead and go AFK. It's now been quite a while, and we now have enough strength to go ahead and defeat this dude. To be honest, it took quite a bit longer than I thought. I think it's been around an hour, not too sure, but it did take quite a bit longer than I thought, mainly because I don't have like all my game passes and stuff. But anyway, let's go ahead and defeat this dude. So over here, let's turn on our auto clicker. You do want your auto clicker, or else you may not be able to defeat him. And all right, so I think we should be able to defeat him. If not, we may need to grind like 100,000 more strength. And it's been going like back and forth for like 30 seconds now. So I'm just gonna end it, grind like 200,000 more strength, and then we should be able to beat him. But for now, let's go ahead and defeat this dude. So there we go, easy peasy. And then we get that free pet right there that will also go ahead and trade our main account. We'd also defeat this dude for the badge. The badge is kind of useless since we're never going to use this account again. But there we go, we got the hunt badge. So let's just go ahead and grind like a quick 200,000 more strength. Should only take like five minutes. And then we should have enough strength to go ahead and defeat this dude over here. It's now been about five minutes and we definitely have enough strength to defeat this dude. So here we go, let's go ahead and turn on our auto clicker. And we should easily be able to beat him. And it is going down right now just because the start tapping thing down here at the bottom is just like warming up. So whenever it starts to slowly go, we should easily be able to defeat him. Not as quickly as I thought, to be honest, but we're still able to defeat him. So there we go. And awesome. We got a robo dragon. So let's see if it is best friend nine. So this one right here and Sally is best friend eight as well. The best friend nine is pretty rare, but if you keep doing this over and over, you should eventually get a best friend nine. I'm not too sure what the chances are, but anyway, once you get the pet, what you do is you just trade your main account again. So basically once we get the pet, we just trade over all of our pets. So there we go. We gained one Robo Dragon from that. Very sad that we didn't get anything good. But anyway, let's go ahead and accept that. And there we go. That should go ahead and go through. But anyway, that's how you go ahead and get an infinite amount of these pets. Very easy. And also, while you do all that on an alt account, what you can do is on your main account, just keep grinding gems because you do have a small chance to actually get it from that dude. But yeah, anyway, that's how you go ahead and get an infinite amount of the best friend 9 pets though. So that's going to be all for this video. So make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And I'll see you all in the next video.